in the big picture, kind of give us a sense for even in non-disease states, what is happening over time as we age to brain uh, metabolism? Yes, uh, focusing on the energy metabolism, uh, one of the most prominent uh, changes is what happens with our mitochondria. Mitochondria only have a very limited amount of DNA that is devoted for the proteins that they need to survive and produce the energy. And then the rest uh, has to come derived from nuclear DNA and chip into the mitochondria. What happens as a function of aging is that uh, some of this uh, mitochondria starts accumulating defects linked to their cellular respiration in the process of so-called oxidative phosphorylation, especially when you have excess oxygen that is not fully reduced into water, that becomes a reactive oxygen species. And there is a key enzyme there. This is the last enzyme in this so-called electron transport chain, catalyzed the reaction of oxygen into water. That reaction is the one that is coupled with the oxidation to produce ATP.